Now, as mentioned, if you want to win a copy of these books by John John M. Collins, which teach you how to create more than forty types of paper planes, email us at razortv at sph.com.sg with the subject heading "I love paper planes." Now, if you look at this book, you'll find some of these fantastic models. Yeah. Some of them are rather complicated. And may require two to three attempts to get it right, but <laughs> yeah, um, we should know. <laughs> yeah, we should know. We we sat down for hours trying to get some of this right. Uh, like the starfighter, that's pretty complicated, and the starship shuttle, yeah, and the <clears throat> interlock biplane. Remember how long you took to the the interlock biplane? <laughs> Sheets of paper are wasted, no. But okay, so we're gonna teach you how to make one of these cool paper planes, and it's called the Stealth, like the we stealth. told you earlier, the Stealth. And so we have some paper here. It's recycled paper. Don't worry. By the way, this is called the pl- uh, the bat. Yeah, the helmet, bat plane. It is really cool. This I love it. Really it really cool. looks like the bat. It doesn't fly that well, but but you know, it looks okay. really cool. It's for putting on your desk and impressing girls with it. Uh. <laughs> okay, I'd be impressed. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll be impressed. Okay, now this, by the way, doesn't look like much of a plane, but it really flies like a dream. It calls, it's called the front four. Now it looks, it looks really dull. All right, and you can actually fold it in a few, uh, in a few steps. But uh, it moves in the most interesting way. What it does is that it, it, you need to fly it probably from somewhere at the top because yeah. it, it, um, it, it flips. And then it flips again, and then it flips. It falls like a falling leaf, it's a except flippy, yeah. flippy plane. <laughs> a flippy plane, except it's more elegant than how okay, a leaf might fall Okay, let's see how it flies. Do I see how it flies? What? I want to see how it flies. No, you gotta like stand somewhere oh, at the yeah, top. They so have to like drop it. Like you just that. have to take my word for it. <laughs> okay. It does the like, like up down dipping. Yeah, thing. exactly. Oh. And and sometimes it even flips the other way. Oh, nice. So and and there are there are. You know, models in this plane that that work pretty much like the boomerang, where they just go one round and they come back to you. Awesome. It is that cool. Awesome. Anyway, all right. So now we're gonna teach you something that is not too difficult, but still it's easy. It's beautiful. It flies like a dream, and it's called the stealth. The stealth. Shall we, Christine? Yay! Okay. <laughs> all right. Yes. Um, how are we gonna? First, you need to get one of these. Uh, uh, just an A4 sheet of paper. Yeah. Now it's actually good to use a recycled piece of paper because uh, what happens is that when uh, when a paper has gone through the photocopier machine, the heating process makes the paper a little bit harder, uh-huh. and and that's good for the paper. I didn't know that. Yes, wow, so. <laughs> you didn't read the introduction <laughs> so introductory <okay>. chapter. <laughs> Yeah, I so, should read one of these books, but yeah. Okay. So apart from being really environment friendly, we're actually yeah, we actually have good paper for making paper plates. Yeah. Awesome. Okay, so it's okay. So it's that simple. First of all, what do we do, Christine? Okay, first you get a piece of paper and you fold it in half lengthwise. So just make sure that you make a nice crease and make sure that all the corners are even. There you go. Easy enough. See? See? Yeah. It. So it opens like that. Ooh, ooh. Mm-hmm. Okay. And then now, um, you fold the corners of the center crease. So you take this corner and fold it all the way down to the fold, to the crease that you just made. Just fold it nice and neatly. And do the same for the other side as well. So here's the other side. Here's the other corner. Just fold it down like that. Nice and easy. Mm. I feel like I'm in an arts and crafts class. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then we're, we're gonna cheat because uh, you know how it is in in uh, cooking shows. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, ta da! <laughs> it's done. <laughs> Just snap your fingers and it's here. Yeah. No. Okay. Now, uh, now once you've done these, okay. Uh, what you have to do is fold it inwards so that this edge, this edge right here, uh, touches the end of the paper. So right here, okay, okay, like so. Now try fold it nicely because it will determine how your plane will fly. Yeah. If you fold it badly, your plane will yeah. If, either if, go too left, if you don't fold too it right, nicely, or just keep 
you know, plunging downwards. Yeah. If you don't fold it nicely, your planes won't be as awesome as mine and homies. <laughs> <laughs> so make sure you fold it nicely. Okay. Okay. Now, once you've got that, you've got to fold it this way. All the way back. All the way back so that this edge would touch um, the end of this edge. There the you go. center line of this edge. Nice and easy. Okay, what next? Okay, then we fold. Right, okay. Now, what do you need to teach them? Do you know, do you know where we are? Okay. Yes. Then we fold this way. Okay, we fold from this corner all the way down. Mm -hmm. And just bring it through the center crease that you made earlier. So make sure that you actually make sharp creases, guys, because they're very, very useful guide rules for when you're doing your other folds. So mm -hmm. like the, the preliminary creases are actually guide rules for the future creases that you will have to make. So now it looks like this. Yeah, right? it should look like that. Now, now, if you realize there is a pocket here. Yeah, see? There is a pocket here. See? Ooh, pocket. There's a pocket here at the back. Yeah. Now, you need to... Mm, how do I show this to the camera? <laughs> Okay, you need to like sort of fold it inwards. Yeah, you need so to that fold it tucks it into the pocket. Get it? Yeah. You need to fold it inwards nicely so that uh, so that the end crease here is uh, nicely tucked away like the rest of it. Yeah. Okay. Go help me, you can do it. Okay, so you do it for the other side as well. Ooh. Now, the thing about making paper airplanes is that you have to have, like, really good dexterity. Okay, you're <laughs> actually really close to completing this plane. Yeah. Now, once you've done that, uh, what do we do? <laughs> okay, so now it looks like this, right, guys? That's right. All right, so we tuck <clears throat> it in, and then you're almost done. Okay. You just have to make the little wing thingies that make it really aerodynamic and makes it fly nice. Right. Right. So, so, okay, this is the back, right? Mm -hmm. This is the back where we've been working at. Flip it the other way. Okay, and fold it in half. Yeah. Fold it in half. Fold it in half. And then, um, if you have a width of about, like, uh, your thumb, fold it like that. <laughs> And then do it, do the same thing for the other half as well. So basically, all you have to do is um, replicate what you do for one side for the other side. Okay, you've done that. And now what about the sides, Christine? Okay, and then now it looks like this, right? It has three folds since we folded it. And <laughs> then you just fold it a little bit more. like Upwards so. yeah. for the sides? Fold it upwards. And... And fold it. Yeah. Okay. That way as well. And you fold it that way. Okay, and then the, the last step is kind of tricky because we need to fold it. You need to fold. Okay, so let's fold it like, like okay. this. Basically. Right? It looks like that, right? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't look like a real paper plate, but it will, I promise. Okay. okay. Now, then, once you've done that, what you have to do is that you need to fold the sides. Yeah. Can you close in? All right. Once you have this, remember, we've done that. Yeah. Once you've done that, you need to fold this uh, sort of symmetrically. Symmetrically. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Symmetrically, so, and likewise for the other side, symmetrically, hey, you're and the there you have it. <laughs> okay, what you have right now is the stealth. The stealth. It's a very simple plane, but it yes, flies it really well and it flies really far. <laughs> I and just now, uh, <laughs> Christine just cheated the way they do in cooking shows, where she just <laughs> dropped the one that she was working on and picked one that actually works. <laughs> no. I'm gonna stick to the one that I just made. <laughs> it's not gonna fly very well, but what the hell? Okay. So uh, there you have it. 
Okay, so uh, now, uh, like I said before, uh, the beauty of this book is that you've got uh, plenty of uh, different kinds of models, and uh, you know, I actually met this man a few months ago, oh, okay. and he did some really fantastic things with the paper plane. He had one where um, it's like a it's like a circle. And it actually stayed in mid-air. What he has to do, nice. however, is that he has to like carry a little, uh, like a little cart with him. Okay. And then he has to blow on the cart, <laughs> and this little plane will just fly along. Oh my god! It's really, it's really, really That's cool. That's really awesome. Yeah. Well, what we forgot to tell you guys is we actually have a special treat because when you open the first page, uh, Ta -da! it's signed. Ta -da! The books like, have been signed by yeah. Mr. John Collins himself, and he says... Mr. Genius Paper Man, he it says... says, here's Lupin at you. Isn't here's cute? Lupin at you. Yeah. That's so cute. <laughs> so yeah, if you send us an email, you will be one of the lucky winners of these really, really awesome books, which will be sure to keep you busy for a really long time, <laughs> like it did me and Helmy. So make sure to email us. That's right. TV. Just don't do it in the office because <laughs> everybody thought we were skiving. No, we were Even when we said this is official, they didn't believe us. Okay, <laughs> shall we? Yeah! Alright, cameras, ready? One, We're gonna try. One, two, three! Woo! <laughs> All right. Okay, uh, we, okay this bad. is the bad, the bad one. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> this doesn't fly so well, but, um, but... it looks really cool. Yeah, it looks really cool. It's called the bad plane. Okay, fly and help me. Oh, no, see what I mean? <laughs> that wasn't well made. That's why it plunged. <laughs> Ooh, this one is our like our top model. Top this is of the called. Line. This is also. This is called the interlog. It's now this took Christine hours to do, <laughs> but let's see whether it works. Okay, I fly it this way. Yeah. Okay. One, two, three. Woo! <laughs> not bad. <laughs> now I'm not sure what this is called. Oh. What is this? Um, okay, it doesn't matter. But it's it's a very complicated looking model. Yes. Uh, involving quite a lot of folds. It took us hours to make it as well. It looks really beautiful, but it let's flies. see. Let's see. It crashed. Ah! <laughs> it it's see a crash I mean? landing no, plane. No, but uh, to be sure, it's not always the fault of the book. It also has to do with Christine and my extremely amateurish folding yeah, techniques. So. Now, uh, this is the one, like I said, uh, it, it, it sort of, it, if I threw it from a high, it, it floats down like a leaf, nice. but, it, but it, it would flip and flip and flip. It's nice. very beautiful, but you won't okay. be able to see quite the effect. Okay. I will try. Oh, wow. Wow. You get the idea, right? You get that the idea. That bad. Okay. <laughs> Are we done? <laughs> Are we done? <laughs> All right, thank you so much for joining us. Um, don't forget, we're going to be covering the finals of uh, the Red Bull Paper Wings at NTU. We're going to bring you a front seat as well as another Rage episode. Yeah. Thank you. Bye-bye. Don't forget. I love Paper Plates. Bye. I love Paper Plates. Bye. 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 <laughs>